the Smithsonian, in conjunction with the Kentucky Humanities Council, selected Wayland as the first of five stops for the hometown team's exhibit to be on display in Kentucky. The exhibit is open free to the public to educate the impact the sports world has had on the American fabric of life. We want people to come out and see what one little tiny community can do. I mean, Wayland's not four or 500 people. It's incorporated. It's a great town. They've got a vision. We've got a vision for that gym. It's going to be a Mountain Sports Hall of Fame. That's going to be our museum. Hopefully later on in the year we will have our first inductees into the Hall of Fame. And it covers regions 13 through 16. So we're going from Harlan County, Corbin, Clay County, uh, Hazard, all the way down into the river cities down in Ashland. And the Smithsonian exhibit will be in Wayland until April 22nd, with special events beginning this Saturday. Now, this Saturday will be our grand opening. We, we opened this past Saturday, but this Saturday is our grand opening. The Kentucky Humanity Council's uh, Pee Wee Reese imitator. Pee Wee was from Louisville, so we've got him in here this baseball season. He will be here, give a free 45 minute uh, uh, talk and, and show. Uh, what's, what's special to me here is, is the, really, is the gymnasium. This gymnasium, uh, you walk in it and you could feel you could feel presence in it. The uh, even though it was open probably in the uh, 40s, Kelly Coleman played here and he was Kentucky's first Mr. Basketball. Kelly Coleman made Wayland known. Be sure to check it out. I sure enjoyed it, and I can guarantee you there is something for all to see in Wayland. Reporting for EKB Sports, I'm Michaela Colley.